And hello. Oh. Today is a day where we go back to more building yet again on GTNH. Everybody's favorite thing to do. I've done a little bit uh, between streams. We have got an entire other layer complete, which is good. I have started mining out a little bit more so we can extend these down. Um, been making sure all the ore processing's been good. It's been running. But, um, yeah, mainly just need to mine the rest of this out. Get this darn ore layer and uh, do our thing. And this is Stardew music. And I'm not going to complain. It also seems that the mob repellators have been working uh, as they should, which is all good. Um, yeah. Hey, QI, how's it going? Yeah, we've just been, we've just, I've just been doing a little bit of things off stream, not much else, to be honest. Um, the tire though is fine. Yeah, I can get that QI. Working stuff like that always seems to happen, you know. My frame rate also seems to be having be behaving itself a little bit better today in general. Um, I've been able to get away with playing some games that have uh, actually not destroyed my frame rate, which is a bit odd, but um, yeah. Uh, a quick restart of the computer actually I think has helped today before stream. Hey, hyper. Hmm. Yeah, I've just realized why you've shown up, haven't? Yep, you've shown up because you. Def oh fuck. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna wait a minute until you mention it, cause uh, yeah I'm I'm not gonna mention it first. I'm I'm a wit. <laughs> it's, yeah, no, I'm, I'm just gonna wait. But yes, hello hyper. How's it going? I totally don't know why you're here today. No, no clue whatsoever. Why would you be in my chat? Hmm. Ah. By the way, Koi, uh, also, I hope you, uh, hope you can feel a bit more energized soon. Because I know it is a pain in the ass to be freaking wrecked and tired. I'm wait, but you still owe me push-ups. There we go. There we go. Okay. Give me two seconds then, chat. I have to do push-ups for Hyper, because Hyper redeemed them just as I was ending stream, like, maybe a month back, and I still haven't done them for So, I'm gonna do that now. <laughs> so... Ah. Nice and easy, five push-ups. There we go. Let me put my headphones back on. Oh. There you go, Hyper. You happy now? You happy now? I've done I've done the five push-ups I over here. I need to change my redeem to be like yeah, I need to change my routine to actually say 5 now, because I haven't changed it in a while. It still says 3. Thank you. You're welcome. Uh, Hyper, I'm guessing you're on your phone from how delayed some stuff is. Let's 
Because I know mobile Twitch can be very delayed for, like, no reason whatsoever. Um. Yeah, we're just gonna have to finish. I think we actually might get the bottom bit of uh, this building done today, to be perfectly honest. With uh, how it's been turning out recently, we might even get this done. And once we get this done, we can start working on the top bit. Once we get the top bit done, we can start shoving machines in here willy nilly. And. Then we can start building and making progress. We're well, not building. Then we can start making progress, stuff, which will be good. Uh, plus, my internet been uh, very slow recently. Why you lurking most chance? Ah, eh, gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, but mobile Twitch, I don't know, adds like an extra like freaking three minute delay to streams that I'm so confused why it does that. It genuinely bamboozles me. I'm like, if I go to the website on my phone, it's proper. But if I go to the app on my phone, it's the three minute delay. And I'm like, why? What is wrong with you? Weird mobile Twitch usually a second ahead of my desktop. Hmm. Weird indeed. Because for me, it's always behind compared to my desktop. That's how it goes. Just how it goes. <clears throat> oh, but yeah, Kyoi, how is Garden of Grind treating you today? Um, let's get rid of that dirt. Well, I've had a bad connection to the server, so I can't really play. Ooh. Yes, that's not fun. Not fun at all. Eat some food. Get rid of that gravel and continue until we hit more gravel and then we'll do like this. Get rid of that gravel. Why does it have to be so much gravel anytime I go mining? Or anytime I'm trying to do anything. There's always just gravel. It's like, oh, you're doing I don't know, XYZ? Do you want to build something? Ah, gravel, I'm gonna put it in your way. Um but in general, uh, mass parallelization, 16x assembly lines, and get a split banner set up yesterday. Nice! Very nice. But yeah, Diddy apparently has set up a new run today, um, on the 2nd of March. Don't, 
Boom, boom. All right. This layer is nearly done, from what I can tell. I think. Another regular run or some challenge run? It's it's gonna be target rule passable, right? But it's also gonna have a few twists on it. Um, from what I've seen. From what I've read on Diddy's Discord, essentially, um, it's going to be a bit of, uh, everything is going to be, like, freaking passive, uh, or a lot of things are going to be passive, and the passive line needs to outperform its bottleneck, so no line can be bottlenecking, which is annoying, it's a little bit annoying, but also reasonable. Um, at least the output, from what I understand, and that the BS has to be, or no, that, um, what am I call it? That anytime machines, like a, an entire tier, if we want to go up a tier in the quest book, or to a new tier in the quest book at all, we need to complete the entire the entire quest, but including optional quests, before the, uh, the tier would go up. Oh no, it's not that, no, it's just passive lines cannot bottleneck. Auto-crafting lines, if we just, up, I, I, I don't know how he's gonna do it. It's gonna be a bit of a, a bit of a hard one, but, you know, it is what it is. We'll see what the B man gets gets a run to. You know? Apparently he's also playing create before uh he starts up the run anyway. He's playing a bit of with the create mod. Which I personally quite like, but you know, a lot of people don't. I don't like it too much, but I would definitely play with the create mod. If uh, I was told to pick between that and Mechanism, I'm definitely picking Create, because Mechanism... Uh, I can't deal with Mechanism. Used way too much, in my opinion. And I can comment on that, maybe I should check it on the uh, stream? Yeah, maybe. Okay. And we just uh, mine this out of the way, and then we'll be good to do on the next le level here, and uh, try and get the walls filled in. No, we're very close. Very, very close, if anything. Okay. Then we'll get rid of that. Two of those, and big squares. Um, let's go for that. We got Magnetite Van. There's so many vans just chilling around, uh, underground. Right next to my base. It's just... It's good, but also a little bit annoying. And 
fact, we go and get to get rid of all of this excess dirt and shenanigans that we don't need. There we go. That is not where I was supposed to mine, but okay. Um, gray granite, you can fill in there. Oh, oh, I don't. All righty. And we'll try and get rid of this. I just got a sharp pin on my chest. Amazing. Sure as hell love that. Get out the black granite. That is not where I placed you, and you know that. Get rid of that. Get rid of that, and that. Perfect. And then a little bit of block there. Perfect. Now we're gonna need to go and grab some more cobble. This stack should do it. <clears throat> Past that, so we're good now. Nice. And uh... Hello? Hello? Is that a cat? Yes. Don't what worry, I... today I'm not playing TF2, don't... No, what if I, what if I said cat? What? Uh, huh? Cat doesn't matter. Yes. So, um, today I'm not going to play Team Team Fortress 2 until I'm done with this, and what I'm doing right now is I'm doing my homework. Well then, do it and stop joining my stream VC. No, I want to talk with people, and it's boring to sit alone, so well, why not? Well then, go talk to someone else. I already... 
who isn't streaming. I already harassed someone else right now. I've already harassed someone else today, so it's not gonna happen. But I'm streaming. Fair that enough. Is, that is the issue. What, what, what if I, like, uh, what's it called? There you go. No. What, what if... Just no. You're just not gonna do them? No. Yeah. Don't do them. You don't wanna? You just don't wanna? Don't wanna. Okay. Just don't wanna? What if I'm forcing you to do them? Mm, or I would ask you politely to leave. It's fair enough. Because I just wanted to vibe. Okay, fair enough. Then I'm just gonna leave. Bye then, cat. Cat, if you're even if you're lurking in stream, I don't mean like any offense by not wanting you in VC. It's just that I'm genuinely just trying to vibe today. Don't really want to be pressured to just talk in VC and then find conversation topics constantly because I'm not good at that. Kind of want to vibe, play some Minecraft. And you're never going to believe this chat. We are out of uh, bricks again. As per usual, apparently. Okay. So, play. Give. No, not yet, Kyoi. We need to set it up. We need the new building first, and then we're going to put a uh, play line in there. We just haven't got around to it. Just have not got around to it yet. Okay. The old bears. Okay. And turn these into small piles. Perfect. Dump a bunch in there. Dump another bunch in there. Dump the rest in there. Perfect. Now that should be half automated for right now. That should just produce this clay. And in here we have some thorium and monazite and stuff. I am going to definitely just steal. Perfect. That's gonna keep centrifuge and stuff, right? Yeah. Okay, back to the new base. Up we go. Out of space for monazite. <clears throat> there we go. Just to be safe, I'm going to put a another one in there. Because we never know how much we're going to need. Dump that in there. Put that away.
then this is going to get all the crush. Perfect. I'm going to need to go up to the ore processing, dump all this where it's effective chests and stuff. So you go in there. There we go. Just look at all the stuff that's being processed constantly in here. What a lot. More thorium. Yes, I love the fact that uh, Centrifuging Monazite does give me thorium because goddamn is that good. For me at least. Because free thorium is uh Fine by me. My reactors still need power. Let's uh, go take a quick gander on the uh, four rigs then. That is part of fuel or out of uh, drilling fluid. Getting full. This guy. Move that there. That's fine. Eh, we'll take this. Uh, if you're not gonna do them, can I get my points back? Uh, cat, I'm gonna do them in a wee minute here. Actually, I'm gonna do them in a minute and just genuinely just want to get some of this things. Uh. Some little bit of maintenance around the stuff done first. So don't worry about it. It'll be done in a minute. Uh, let's just take this guy. We'll put you there for now. We'll then grab this. Well, here. And put those there. Four, three. There's another empty fluid tank. Oh, I didn't lock that one. That's even weirder. That one's still trying to recover. Okay. The new. Get all this stuff dumped off, and then I'll do that uh, push ups and plank for you, cat. I'm gonna have to check those chests in a wee while. Okay. Well, let's head up here. Let me grab my conduit pro.
Perfect. Alright, let me do that then. We're just gonna give you a nice view of the ore processing. There we go. Yeah, this is going to take its sweet, sweet time going through all this stuff. Alright, it's processing appetite and beryllium. Some limonite. It's going to take a couple steps of Appetite, and I'm just gonna go. Nope. Because I cannot be bothered anymore. Okay, stack patches. Dump that in there. <clears throat> hmm. Ah, hey, you know what? Fuck it. We're gonna uh, switch back to electric swing today. I think. So we're going to listen to an electro swing. There's one. This should keep me awake. There we go. No. What do we want to do? Got ourselves a box site. We got all that stuff. Anything else we can do right now at this very moment in time? It is. Oh, yeah, we smelted up some bricks. Dump them in there. You kidding me? Back to the old base. Play. Start of water. That hasn't happened in a wee while. Two, three, four, five, six. There's 13.
And there we go. Okay, and back to the new base we go. There's three mining fluid tanks we need to change out. And lock that, please. Thank you. There was something else I wanted to do here, which was uh, swap out my food. There we go. Okay, good. Um, back to the new base. If my frame rate would be nice to me, this would be great. I meant to request two stacks of them in one go. Amazing. Okay. Don't need that bookmarked anymore. Um, yes. So that's getting more done. Downstairs is looking half decent. We do need more andesite brick though. So. We'll grab all of this. We grab all that, we got our chisel. Then back to the chisel and the site. Then we're gonna go for the tenure bricks for two and chisel bricks for two. Thrust that back in. We're also gonna want some hobble. Get two stacks of them. In with that. Um stone bricks on the other hand, we're gonna want Quite a bit of it, so yeah, four. Yeah, four stacks. Should do. I'm not, I'm not sure if I should listen to Electro Swing or should I listen to Blow Fi. I'm in the mood. Thing is, I'm so freaking between the two. Is the issue. I don't know what to listen to right now. I think just listening to Lo-Fi may be better. Stone is then going to need to be chiseled into bricks. Three of those, one cracked. Perfect. Give me two seconds.
Sorry about that. I had a good phone call. Okay. So we now have tanks that we need to go and redistribute. Our chisels near dead. That's fine. We've already got a spare one. Waiting for those bricks to finish up, and then we can go add more down in the basement. Um, I'm gonna need more spruce. Give me that. Okay, and let's go and head over to the new base. Not the new base, but the new base. The new building of the new base that does the thing with the thing. Yeah, you can definitely tell which ones are from what mod, because that's from Chisel and that one's from Tanya. The Chisel one's a lot more darker darker border. Okay. This is going to need to go up a little bit more, I would say. I'd say to here would be good. That gives us good clearance. Or pretty decent clearance, at least. Now we'll go up another one just to be safe. Okay, cool. Um, now I need to go back here. The bricks should be done. Perfect. Uh, just a little stack of them to varied. I need to head back across again. And go downstairs. Okay, and then in some of this. Perfect. I do not want to break there. And then step in. Perfect. And we don't have enough bricks for another section. So, more clay is needed. So, back to the old base. Yes, give me a single regular chest, please. Perfect. Also go and take this and dump this in the drawer because I completely forgot about this. Alright, dump down there. 
Then next we're going to need to put the rest of this in. Alright. <clears throat> that is doing good. That is, uh, narrowing an entire stack of brick. Perfect. Let's go and do this manually, because it's easy enough. Oh yeah, I was gonna go and check the chest to make sure they weren't just filled with random pieces of appetite. Oh, okay. Um... Where was the, uh, emerald? There we go. Good. Thank you for the hydric, joy. I don't think I have a lutinium drawer. No, I do. Okay, calcite is full, so we'll grab a torch up for it to slap that there. Right, calcium phosphate. Dump that in there. Thrust that in there. Perfect. I also saw that there was still some stuff over here, but that's fine. That can go upstairs with the ore processing. really hard to find a uh, find an elevator when you're drinking water yeah look at this it's we're getting tons more titanium which is amazing I love my titanium Should be getting close to actually 7,000 titanium soon.
Um, good. Next thing's next. We need to get those stacks for it. Mine now. Now we got an hour four stacks on our hands. Give me all of that play. Old bass. that one is here oh. no I do not want my chisel in there thank you very much There we go. One monazite and thorium. What here could we take back and just shove straight into the ore processing because we might as well? Nothing really. Um. Let's go and fill these. Put the other four in there. And put them back in the tank. Back to the new base. An hour four stacks. Turn that into very shift in my backpack. That's also another thing. I should probably grab some more black granite. Hello there. Hey, Jess. How's it going? Making food currently, just back from being a uh, social bean. Ah, I got you. Let's, uh, like granite cobblestone. Nice, five stacks of black granite brick. There we go. 
There's our roofing. Put that in there for right now. More stack of bricks, go in there. I just realized I haven't went back and given all of the ore plants their, uh, their tank of drilling fluid. Which they need. Okay, neat. That's gonna work nice. How are we doing on batteries? Pretty good. Just checking something real quick. Okay. That makes a lot of sense. Now. That was why I was curious. We good now. And I'm starving. Cool. Bricks? What the f English? Excuse me? Those bricks should, uh, be making- Blah, 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 blah. Those bricks should be, uh, getting made up now. Anyway, let's look at, uh, stuff we can smelt up, like, Calc Pyrite, Pyrite, Luminite, uh, Magnetite, Iron, God, I love flowing, overflowing my inventory with stuff that needs smelted. Okay, let's uh, dump all of that into there. Okay, 
and we'll go dump the rest in. There we go. Need a little bit more food. Perfect. Bunch of copper, dump it in there. Another stack of bricks. Nearly there. Two, three, four. Okay. That'll make us an ore stack of bricks, hopefully. We still have so much uh, stuff that I want to get auto-processing lines for, but uh, we're just not there yet. Especially the metal mixture. The metal mixture I want to get processed. In a multi-block. Centrifuge, so once we're in the new base. Or, not the new base, once we have the new area built up enough. I want to show ourselves a multi-block centrifuge and just process all metal mixture. Right into... Banded iron, oxide, parcelite, blue iron, all that good stuff. Then just immediately smelt the uh, iron is what I'm thinking. And the barite. I even just set up like a multi smelter that I auto export to. Maybe worth, maybe worth it. Maybe worth it. Just to smelt all the shit that we have to go under. Oh yeah, Nyangi was supposed to be streaming today, wasn't she? Yeah, she was supposed to be doing some Celeste, but she's been up all night, so she's went to sleep. Which is understandable. Okay, let's go do a couple sections of the uh, new building. Okay, a stack of that, a stack of that. Then we'll go across. Perfect. So each one should require at least 20 of one block and 19 of the other. And this should be fine. Yep. Well, no. I miscounted. For it. So here we'll go. Three, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 
10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. And my math was correct. I'm going to use bricks first. So, three, eight, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Okay. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That's just 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Yep. Okay. 1, 2, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 16, 17, 18, 20. That is not where that was supposed to go, and you know that. And we wait on the next batch of brick. But apart from that, this is looking good. Okay, uh, heart is bricks appeared in, not enough, that is ore, not old. Old this, please. There we go. We'll just let that do its thing. There has to be like a better like alloy smelter, right? There is, there is, there is. Design engine. It requires Inconel, okay. Six two five and seven nine two, okay, amazing. Um an ink alloy, DS, great. And an IV alloy smelter. This is definitely super easy. Integral encasement B or integral encasement five requires EV machine casing, Incoloid DS, Incoloid DS gears, titanium workstation, and Inconel. Inconel. Nickel, niobium, nichrome. Aluminium, niobium is the only thing I do not have right now. I could be lying. I can get it from Pyrosolite. I probably already have some niobium somewhere. We also get it from Pyrochlor. We also get it from Pentolite, so I should actually have some. If I look at my system and I have ni no niobium, I will be confused. I do have niobium. Good. I need that eventually. For some shenanigans. Uh, what can we work on in the quest as well? well? If I take a gander quickly. None of that. 
And we just... We can make the EV circuit assembler, actually. That's not too bad to make, but uh, let's... Let's make that. Most likely... Oh! Two conveyor modules, okay. Do those, please. Okay, so that's doing that. Um, oh, a second bricks. There. Okay. Just waiting on the motors being made. They shouldn't take too long. Just waiting on black steel. Which... Is... Being made. Good. The amount of bows we have is a bit concerning. Oh well. Like the amount of stuff that we just have one of sitting in our system is a bit annoying, but whatever. I've got a miner's backpack in my system. I didn't know that. Who's in our Let's go. Huh. I now have another miner's backpack. This is good. <laughs> How did I not... Have I accidentally just shift-clicked one in without realizing? Probably. But I only thought I had three. Because I upgraded from one to two to then three. I don't know where the fourth ones come from. Magic. Just magic. Got a bit of neodymium, which is nice. Give me those six bricks, I need them. That's one conveyor module. Was I requesting an LCR last time? Oh yeah, for the plat line. Let's go install that, because I at least I know what to do with this.
Okay, we'll go here, here, here. Perfect. And dump that there. So we take the rhodium sulfate, we dump it in a LCR with some water, that's easy enough, I can do that with a reservoir hatch. Take that rhodium sulfate. We got two fluid outputs and one, yeah. Put an input hatch that goes here. This leech residue we also get from this, isn't it? Yeah, that's what we get from this. So we're going to take that leech residue and we're just going to continue it. Huh. I just realized this recipe isn't even better. This recipe is better overall. I think. Maybe not. I'm gonna do some math. Uh, calculator, come to me. 39 divided by 11. 3.45 times that by 10. 35 divided that by 9. Gives me 3.93. This is better for the leech, for the leech shit, or the leech residue. Okay. That's fine then. Uh, just grab a, a wrought iron fluid pipe will do. We'll put the water hatch there. And we'll also need to go for... They're not equal though, Kyoi. They're a bit... It's a bit skewed with how the freaking recipe was done. I don't know why. Input bus go top center. Face inward. Then output hatch. We'll put... Two of them. One will go here, and we'll lock that to potassium. Molten potassium will go there. Um, We're going to take that rhodium sulfate solution uh, from here. And that's going to go into another... The basic chem reactor should do that. But an LCR will perfectly overclock, so it's better if you go for the LCR anyway. We're going to need no more LCR. Uh, we're going to need a zinc loop because we get the zinc back. So, let's put in an RLCR here, but the output hatch will essentially put that output hatch there. 
I'm gonna grab the rhodium sulfate solution and lock that there. I just realized I can't do this with MV hatch. An MV hatch here. Yeah, I need a. Uh... I need an M. I need a freaking HV hatch. Okay, back to the console area. HV that is an iron tank plus just an HV machine hole. Okay. So give me two of those. Deal with the machine holes. Please. I need another one of these with nowhere iron tank as well. get that requested up okay put that output hatch in there put those input hatches in there i'm also gonna need to make a reservoir hatch Which means i'm gonna need at least uh i think a five pump so wrap me up five of those Four of those. Yeah, right. Full, uh, full dust is slightly more efficient. Yeah, it's weird. Very weird. Also get me an our EV machine hull and a steel Perfect. Leave that there for right now. Those pumps will take a little minute, but that's fine. Black steel's a pain in the ass, but whatever. This is just waiting on aluminium cable. That's waiting on its subsidian glass. It's waiting on its tanks. That's waiting on its subsidian glass as well. You go there, there. So, output hatches. No, I need two input hatches there. There we go. Where's the output hatch? There's the two tanks for the input hatches.
There's more bricks to get compressed. Let's go put these input hatches down. Output hatch and then input hatch. This needs to be locked on. How fast are we making this? Because this is made at 360, 360 every recipe, right? 360 liters every recipe, which at MV, this is running at HV, so it's divided by 5. That's 72 per second, okay. That recipe that we're doing takes 11k. 11,000 and it takes 60 seconds on LV. It's 181 or 183. Okay, so we're not even bloody close to running this at the speed it needs to go at. If we even want to match the LV speed of this thing. Like, I don't mind changing it to run faster. Like, that's good with me. Let's grab some uh, HV energy hatches. Two of those, please. One of those. Get me... One. Eh, give me five in her. Might as well. Uh, you've got all the pumps now. That'll make us our reservoir hatch. Nice.
Oh, I should probably also tell the system to go for an ORLCR. Eh, put that there. Nice. Um... Go down here, grab the rest of these bricks that are hopefully all done. Nearly all done. Buried, buried. Need to wait twice or one more time on that, and then that's good. Okay. That's good. Typically in our casings, we're just waiting on the energy hatches. They're making energetic alloy wire. I don't know why that would be taking so long. I oh, know it's it's getting done now. And that's why I don't have a speed downgrade in this thing. I need to speed down grid. That's a filter. I'm also at a filter, so make a second then, would you? Be great. How's that LCR doing? It's nearly done. Two energy hatches are inert casings. And our brick. BHV energy hatches. Perfect. Then down here, or not even down, we can just put it here. So up top, we're going to want our LV hatch, where our energy hatch at least. Which means that, that get filled in. Go and dump the rest of this up here. I actually need to bring it over to here. Actually, no, it was fine where it was. Okay, so we'll go back down here. I just need a normal transformer.
the low voltage transformer. Them, please. An MV one. So we go up here, we turn this this way. We do this. Then we do that. That's stepping down from HV to MV and MV to LV. Which is correct. Then this thing. Hundred billion liters, two hundred gigaliters, same thing. Um, get that one. There we go. Uh, we're gonna need to slap this toolbox. Bang. Perfect. Um, running fine. Oh yeah, what circuit is this on? Three. Oh yeah, I'm gonna need a solidifier over here as well. Potassium. Gonna need more ingot mold, I'm guessing. Of course, I don't have a solidifier just sitting around. How much of this am I actually gonna get? That's. Let's see. Seven two hundred uh, divided by sixty gives me one hundred twenty every second. How fast can an LV handle this? Oh, perfect! It's absolutely perfect. So we just need a an LV solidifier. And a bit of a redstone LA cable. And then we're going to need an ingot mold. Which means we're going to need... Or steel instead, and we'll put this on ground four. Let's solidify. We're still waiting on the two pumps. They are done crafting. We're just waiting on them arriving. Oh, solidifier has been made. That out. Dump that in there.
that there. If I put this repenting machine on program one, that'll get us our empty chip. Let me grab our foreman press. Turn into another ingot mold. Wait a second, if I also... How fast is a macerator at uh, LV if I go for potassium ingot? I go for an MV macerator. That was see, that was solve my problems. Okay, MV macerator. It's gonna be a really jank setup for the plant line, but whatever. Bus. Okay, let's go and actually put this blue solidifier where it's supposed to go. Just it. Uh, dip me some fries with peppers, onions, spring onions, hot sauce, salt, and Pepper de garnish. Hmm. Nice. It's tasty to be perfectly honest. Um I had lit my dinner today was toast because I had a chippy for lunch. Which is, you know, completely reasonable. Do we want that to go up? Probably not. Do we want it to go back? Maybe. Might be easier to go back. Then I can also just do that. As an HV superconductor, JJ, you do not want to put that on there. You want an MV superconductor. That is what I want. And we've got our macerator. Never made an MV Macerator, apparently. It was TSD Valve. Exactly. That is not where that was supposed to go. Look at these shenanigans. <laughs> Like, if I turn this on... Huh? Put it... What do you mean it doesn't have enough heart space? It does. I made sure it does. I forgot the item output. That may explain why. And no output bus. Or can I forget the output bus? That is literally one of the most important things.
However, we're good. Actually, I've just realized I don't like where that is. I'm going to move it over to here. Because then it'll be easier. Because I'm going to be running onto it over the top anyway. Well, I don't even need to run conduit over the top. I can segment this soon, which will be good. Then I have a bunch more conduit channels I can play with again. Yeah, we gotta see if this works properly. That is immediately just going for it. Yeah, that's perfect. Absolutely perfect. Actually, yeah, I'm going to be running conduit over the top. I can try and split it so it doesn't go over to here, but it goes over to this one. But I do need an output still. Or I could put a chest over there. That would work too. Let me grab a chest. Output bus. Waiting on that chest. Also, I'm going to double check if I even need this LCR. If I don't, then I'm good. But if I do, then I'm not so good. Okay. So, this thing. Oh yeah, I was gonna move this. Nerd. And then... Rapid bus. Much better. Um... Oh yeah, you. How much do I make of you a second again? Uh, 3,900 every 60 seconds, which is 65 liters a second, okay? Um, you are then... So... Yeah, okay, I do need an LCR. Good. Good, 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 good. LCR is required. I should probably make a mob repel later for this room. That'd be easy enough. I can do that soon. Uh, controller. Oil pipe. Maintenance. Input bus. This one actually needs to be used. Um, it doesn't have a circuit. It just does it. Okay. Cool. Then we'll dump the output bus there. Put PTFE casing all the way around. We're then going to need a... We need to configure this out, so... We get... 3900... 0. 
That's 39,000, not just 3,900. Okay, divide by 60. I get 650. Okay, 650. Uh, 50. Okay, and then this just uses 1,000 every 15. Yeah, this uses 66.5. I need to times that by 10. Which means if I double it once, that goes to MV. Which would reduce it by half to 7.5 seconds. Okay. And if I did it again, that would bring me to EHV. All right. If I did it again, that bring me to EV. Ah. I would need to run this on IV. I don't want to run this on IV. I don't really want to want to. EV is going to be my upper limit for. This. So we're going to run this on EV par. That's two EHV hatches then. Okay, so let's go and make two EHV hatches. Okay, let's uh empty this. Also, we should be able to now go and do some more building. We'll put that there for later. Let's head on over here with that option hand. I think we're building, yeah, priority brick on 20. Okay. And put that as a pickaxe again, please. Oh. And boop, and boop. Perfect. Sixteen, sixteen, seven. Very nice. Oh. Very nice. And 
17, 18, 20. And not enough for an orbit. Okay. This level is nearly complete. We just need an orbit, and then we're good. Okay. It's correct that that's not an HV par. Makes it so much easier. And this can now run whenever. This one, I forgot to hit it with the thing. I can't yet because I don't have the hatches that we're waiting on. We're waiting on an energetic alloy. Which has a dedicated EBF for it? Why is it taking so long? It doesn't have a dedicated EBF, but it has a dedicated quad for that entire group. I'm pretty sure this is the, uh... Has, yeah, it does have energetic in it. It was just wanted to take its time. Oh well. I do love my little, uh, my little tungsten lens being very nice. It's working. Far and through. This then needs conduit. I'm actually running out of conduit. That's another thing I need to work on. Conduit. I'm gonna need... Yes, a stack of electrum. I'm then going to need other stuff. Ender. Yeah, yeah, I should have enough. So back of pulsating. There's my energy hatches. That should turn those into filters. Perfect. I've been needing them. I've been missing not having them. Clapped up with the toolbox. Okay, good. That shouldn't have a valid recipe until we want it to. Um, all this outputs are up here, which is perfect. I then need my. I've accidentally put my chest in the system, haven't I? Great. Oh no, I have it in there. Never mind. Let's 
go up here. There we go. Then we'll put on your your extract on Genta. What else is on magenta? A couple things, but they're all filtered. Okay, good. Because I was about to be very confused for a moment. Wait a minute, that's, that's not good. Um, am I using yellow? Yes. What about pink? Am I using pink? No. Okay, I'm not using pink. Good. So pink will be just, just magic. Full extract. So that'll be on. Pink. There we go. There we go. And then. Give me two seconds. All right, I think this uh, may be a perfect time for me to go on a quick break. Uh, I'm gonna go get a, gonna go to the bathroom, uh, maybe refill my water if I need to, and uh, yeah, if anyone else needs to use the bathroom, get themselves a snack, get themselves, you know, some more water, some more anything really. And uh, but yeah, see you after break. See you in a couple minutes.
And I'm back. Thanks for sticking around during the break. I appreciate it. Thank you for the welcome back, Yoi. And we're going to make ourselves some conduits. There must be a better way to make conduits, right? There's not. Cool. I, I, I was expecting there would be, but... Apparently not. Not even like a big assembly line crafting one for them? Nope. Just... Thing is with me being stuck in this here is that I have a lot of stuff automated, but uh... I'm just falling behind in progression, compared to a lot of other people who were at the same tier as me. Uh, hello Avery! How is the JJ? The JJ is doing pretty alright. we we'll use blue as the first channel here. Extract on... Purple. That's good, yeah. This is good. This means that I can also probably turn this thing back on without much bother. These can then be centralized on a red thing. Like, let me put a drawer or something. Like there. So let me go grab a drawer. Oh, uh, yeah, that one will do. But yeah, how are you doing, Avery? How is, uh, how is today going? I saw you were playing some Hollow Knight earlier. Because I just got the Steam notification earlier today, and I was like, oh, Avery's playing Hollow Knight. That is not the way I want that to face. That is the way I want it to face. Door key that. Sealment key that. Um, that's good. Oh, it's going good. Good. <laughs> um, I don't know about you, 
but I'm pretty sure an item shouldn't have a negative three dura negative three percent durability. Something about that don't seem right. No, all I'm seeing is that's what did you have in it? Because it may have triggered auto mod and I can't see auto mod when I'm in OBS view. Because I'm not in mod view. Is there a word that could be missed? It does. It, did you get a pop up saying auto mod is flagged this or anything? Oh. Went through a breakup two days ago, so. Using games, friends, and stream to deal with it. Oh. Yeah, that sounds rough. Sounds not too fun. I hope everything turns around, though, soon, Avery. I hope everything apart from that is going all right. Yeah, let's, um, what else do we need? Brain. The worst was the days leading up to when it happened. Yeah. I've never been in a relationship, and I don't know when I'll be in a relationship at all. Um, so I don't really have any friggin' experiences with breakup, being in really in love with anyone. So I'm like, I don't know, uh, when most things, but I can get like stress and then anxiety and stuff very easily. Cat, that doesn't surprise you, fucking son of a bitch. I'll, I'm gonna come to Denmark and beat your ass. Uh, broke up in good terms, though, and I think uh, went fairly painless, painlessly, so not feeling as bad as expected. That's, that is good. That is good. As long as you're on good terms with the other person, that's one of the best outcomes you can get. Yes, Kat is from Denmark. He's Danish. Oh, maybe I don't need to go to Denmark to be beat up cat. Ivory, you can do it for me. <laughs> um, what else do I need to do here? I need myself to go back to the old base. We don't have any more clay. We are out of clay. Shit. We need to go mine some more clay then. Ah, uh, uh, cat. I know you speak Danish, but please, re please remember to use English in the chat because I cannot verify if something was appropriate or not. Alright, let's go and, uh, get some... Let's go get some more Clyde that... Woo! Uh... Up in the air we go. I genuinely don't know 
what you and Kat are saying, to be honest, because I know zero DNA. Zilch. I don't even- I can barely remember French and I studied no it for ages. <laughs> Thanks, Jess. <laughs> And confirm nothing inappropriate. Got it. Thank you. Thank you, Avery. Can you believe that Cat used to be one of my moderators on uh, on stream, but then he said he didn't want to anymore because it because he felt like he had a responsibility at that point and he didn't want to feel responsible. The delay. Well, there's got to be a bit of delay, right? There's always a bit of delay with TTS. Just be how it is. Yeah, but Kat used to be one of my moderators, and then he said he didn't want to be my moderator anymore. Bad times. <laughs> nah, I think it was more he got a bit fed up with me complaining about him all the time. And complaining that, uh... Essentially... About him joining VC when he's not not supposed to. <laughs> I prefer when people usually either ask when they join my stream VC or just give me a bit of a heads up. But it also depends on what mood I'm in. I could be in the stream VC and be like, "Okay, I'm ready to talk to people," and then someone joins, I'm like, ah, "I can't fucking be bothered no more." You know. I really can't say what region they were from, and I, and I said, oh, gotcha. Uh, that was me who just flew in twice, once a tiny to shush in a funny way, and the other because I accidentally clicked and rolled in, rolled with it. <laughs> of course. Of course, yes. You just, uh, yeah, just not paying attention, clicks a button, oh, fuck. <laughs> I, I can imagine you just being like, just he hearing me double and go, oh, fuck. <laughs> and panic. What if I was him? <laughs> oh. I, I actually don't have any moderators that show up regularly. Um, I do all the moderation by myself currently. Because I do... Actually, I have Tarovin. But Tarovin's a mod on my Twitch because he helps me with waffles anytime waffles decides to break. And then I used to have Splodgy as a mod. I removed Splodgy as a mod. Splodgy barely shows up nowadays. Um... I have Mimic as a mod, because sometimes he shows up. Um, Waffles is great, I know. Yes, Cat, you are here every stream. But you also cause chaos every stream. I see, you see, there's a, there's a good counterpoint to this. <laughs> Kat, remember when, uh, when I started the GTNH streaming and you kept hopped in VC, right? Remember when all you used to try and talk about was things that are TOS, and I kept trying to stop you? Avery, you weren't here for this, but essentially, when me and Kat, when Kat and me used to, or when I used to stream when I was building this new BS anyway, the new BS, um... Cat would jump in VC, and I kid you not, every single time Cat was in VC, there was at least 15 mentions of explosives, and how to make them. And I was like, please, please just stop. You know, I, I don't really want to be liable for... Oh, someone, look, this is how you make XYZ, 
that is highly explosive. Woo! Ever are you in my Discord? Step one, gunpowder and sand. No. Jess, stop. Stop. <laughs> Jess, stop. Wait a minute, that's the TNT recipe. Wait a fucking minute. That's the Minecraft TNT recipe. You sly son of a bitch. You did not know I had a Discord, so no. I'm very disappointed in you, Avery. Um, let me run the... Is DC a... No, it's not. There we go. Discord. Uh... Excuse me? Waffles? I've just realized Waffles hasn't been running all stream. Uh... Time to go pester to Roven. Yeah, I just said, uh, awful, uh, Jess, um, you'd be so polite to go and grab a, an invite to the Discord. Thank you, Kent. Thank you, Jess. I sure as hell love getting myself tons more hardened clay to turn into regular clay dust than turn into clay because I'm poor. Getting clay flashbacks, yeah, hell yeah, Jess, do it. The trauma. Okay. Okay. You have joined. Very nice. I just claimed your server list. Oh. Did you have over a hundred? I don't know why people can join so many servers. Who broke Waffles? I have no clue. Waffles hasn't been running all streams or open. Not Waffles is running. Does the YouTube command work? Yes, Waffles is not working. Thank you, Tarovan. I appreciate it. Thank you.
uh, so they're on Discord server, and you use it like twice, and then never again, that's fine. Ah, yeah. Here be no problem. Right time to leave JJ's. <laughs> okay. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Go, yeah, definitely, Jess. Thanks. Th thank you so much uh, for being in the Discord server. <laughs> thank you for the thirty-second ad break, Jerovan. I'll play on my next break. Thanks for the push-ups, Jerovan. You you can stop. Not you. Thank Fuck here. <laughs> K okay, bye. What did you just said? K okay, bye. You just did that and went. Nah, I'm already. I'm already here. Classic Torovan. Classic fucking Torovan. Oh yeah, I'm gonna get you to do all these things. I'm just gonna piss off now. Bye. <laughs> Okay, let's head up here, dump all that there. Perfect. Uh, thank you for the hydrate, Jess. I'll do that now, and then I'll do the push-ups and plank. Okay, hydration has been completed. Let's, uh... Park myself here for push-ups and plank. Give me a minute. Okay. That's better. I do love exercises that actually help me build my core a bit better. Ooh. Push ups are not that good at building core, but more just arm strength. Especially since over summer, I'm going to try and work out a bit more. Um, good to feel. Okay, let's see. We're up to 7,000 titanium. Let's go. Look at all that lovely clay. Why is there not a better recipe with, like, frickin' clay dust? Why does it be such a pain in the ass? You know? I know mud balls are a better recipe overall, but... I just don't have them right now.
Okay. Nice. And more play. More clay dust. Okay. Okay. Um, there we go. So, put that in there for an hour. That should make us some more clay, which we need. So we'll let that run for a little bit. Uh, let's go check on ore processing, see how it's doing as well as... Let's go and quickly grab some more water from the reactor. I should definitely make a centralized distilled water plant. Just to be nice. That's half empty, that's half empty. How are these guys doing up here? They're a little bit empty. Not too empty though. There are more appetite in here. Just to get those things running. Which is perfect. Wonder how this is doing. 43 more. Don't mind if I do. Also should take a gander at the box set slag. And, uh... Go process all of that. There we go. Look how much freaking Rutel we're getting already. Uh, there should be a hopper in there. And that's just waiting more clay, which we should be able to go and grab in a second. Yoink. Perfect. Nice. 
That's good to can. At least you... At least you know you don't have to bug your parents every time you want to go somewhere. You can just drive there your goddamn self. Just get in the car and go. Since you're not old- What do you mean you're not old enough? <laughs> if you can legally drive, you can just drive yourself anywhere. I don't see the issue. Do you mean your provisional license or your full driving license, Cat? Do you mean your like your provisional license for like when you have to have so a passenger in the car who's older than you? Oh, your your system's different than ours. Is mine you have to get a provisional license after you pass a theory test? Or before you can even get it before you pass the theory test, uh, you get your provisional license. Then you have to get your full license by doing an or you have to do a practical test and a theory test. Um, once you have both of those done, then you are just allowed to drive wherever, whenever. But you need an R plate on your car, as that means essentially, hey, this person is still limited to forty-five mile an hour. They are not going to go over the speed limit. They are not going to go sixty. Um, and then that stays on your car for about a year, and then it transfers to you don't need an R-plate no more and then you're good to go. I forgot we actually had ME Conduit in GT New Horizons. To be perfectly honest. Okay, so that's processing to a bunch of goodies. That's making us a bunch more bricks. You can start at 16. We can, yeah, we can apply for ours at before, a couple months before our first, before our 17th birthday. Then you can get your provisional before... You're 17 sometimes, depending on how quick things are, and then you can go from there. Okay, let's go put these, uh, go make a stack of bricks. Dump that in there. And we'll go dump this in titanium area. Okay. Oh, we also get this as a reward. Yeah, because we just need that extra space finished up. 
Uh, we could work on more of the serial. Just realized, but, uh... Sometimes I'm stupid. And by sometimes, I mean most of the time. Let's go to the old bisque. Give this more play to feed. Perfect. <clears throat> Even more play. Now that our stack of bricks should be done. There we go. Perfect. I need to make a new thing again. Give me a wrought iron, two wrought iron rods. What's the cat's name in the Discord? The same, just a, just a cat. I'm pretty sure. Oh, I don't think you... Um, let me just give you it. By default. There you go. There you go. I force give you the roll that just takes a minute to get because I just couldn't... I just, a lot of people can't be bothered clicking it, so I usually go in and manually do it if it's someone I know. Okay, let's head over and finish this. Okay. Very nice snarl. We just need to level this entire area and we're good to go. We're gonna get this area done today. That's good to hear. <clears throat> or more or less good to see. And Gravel, my arch nemesis, has reappeared. Oh my god! Welcome in, raiders. Thank you. For the red, math, and blue. I'm going to guess you were playing Craft to Exile today. Uh, but yes, hello, raiders. Welcome in. My name is JJ. I, uh, I mainly play modded Minecraft. Currently, we are playing GTNH. And, uh, I obviously hit myself <laughs> with it. But yes, thank you for the raid, Meph and, uh, Blood. Let me, uh, give you both the F1. Are you going to work? Thank you. Uh, let me give both of you a shot on it. Thank you so much. How was, uh, Craft XL today?
Thank you for the resub map. I appreciate it Hello. a lot. I really do. I really do, Blood. I, f I love hard packs so much. Let me get you a shout out to Blood. If you have not went and followed Meph, I would greatly recommend it. Meph's great. Meph is absolutely amazing, and so is Blood. I'd recommend everyone to go and follow them if they haven't already. I have to wait another uh, a minute for you, Blood, before I can give you a shout out. I'm sorry. <laughs> I've given you the stream elements one. Um, yes, uh, it was nice to went to the nether for the first time. Hell yeah. How, how bad is the nether in uh, Craft Exile? Because I haven't played the pack before. I am doing good, though. I'm doing great, math. Thank you. Uh, Incendium Nether? Hmm. You should? It's a nice pack? Yeah, maybe. I'll look at it at some point, because I'm definitely more of a tech, tech mod guy, who does love expert packs, so, you know. But yeah, that's good to hear. Good to hear that every today was great. Ah, I've spent all of today continuously mining and building because I have run out of space in my current area, and this seems appropriate. As an amount of space, bat, will you bat? <laughs> there we go. Bats, uh, bats are amazing, right? They're great. They're great. Aren't they just mining? Next thing you know, a bat's in your face, and you're just like, well, that's great. Well, it's, just, it's just amazing. A bat's in my face. Exactly what I wanted. I uh, need to run run now. Having a have a great stream. Drop an alert. Much love. That's all right, Math. I hope you have a lovely rest of your night. Goodbye. And I'll I appreciate the lurk. And I'll try and take care of yours and Blue's viewers as much as possible. And also, I'm sorry that I missed the follows during that, but thank you for the follow, Nay, and thank you for the follow, Po. I appreciate it. Give them their water and foods. Uh, the, uh, uh, um, uh, here, have this digital water ticket. Go. <laughs> Take the digital water. Um, <laughs> same goes for me getting tired. Hope you have an amazing stream. Will do, Blood. Hope you have a lovely rest of your night and, uh, have a good rest. I got 100 subs on YouTube. Let's go. Very nice. That is that is another goal that we've reached apparently. Actually, what do I even have for uh, goals right now on Twitch? That's what I'm actually curious about. I Oh, I didn't uh I forgot to change my goal. <laughs> I forgot to change my follower goal. Oh no. I'll fix that later. Oh my god. <laughs> Thank you for the 54 bits, cat. Jesus. Celebrate. I'm not good at celebrating. Like, genuinely, I've like. Brain is like. I don't know how to celebrate. Usually, I spend time inside and just chill, play Minecraft. <laughs> That's how I celebrate things, I don't know. <laughs> um... I don't, I don't know, Cat. I don't know what to do. 
am panicking. Should have been 60. Jess. Be inappropriate as usual. <laughs> No, this is a th What do you mean it's a threat, Cat? What do you mean it's a threat? Always am, always will be. Mm. Of course, of course, of course. Jesus, Cat, what the fuck? Thank you for the 69, Cat. Should have been 69, my hand. <laughs> Fucking... You should stop. I appreciate it, but you should stop. My day's just gotten a whole lot better. <laughs> In general. It's like two. It's like two. Ah, oh, well then, yeah. Okay. If, uh, that's okay. That's 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 grand then, can't. If it if it's a point damage, it's that's fine. It's fine. I just don't want you breaking the bank, cat. That's all. Cause I never like when when people spend a lot a lot of freaking cash on me. That's why I, I'm very like when I people ask me what do I want for stuff, I'm usually just like, eh, just it, I'd rather just have you know twenty quid rather than them buy me something that's worth like a hundred and then be like, yeah, I'm not gonna use this. I always feel like shit when that happens. So that's why I prefer when people don't spend money on me. One dollar seventy five or seventy six cents. Ass. Yeah, you're not breaking the bank, can't you? You're good. You're good. You are good. Okay, let's repair this hammer. It needs some uh, DLC. And there's a piece of water. Remove yourself. Thank you. I'm so happy that Waffles is working again now. Thanks to Tarovan. Tarovan, Tarovan does an amazing job with Waffles. Waffles is great. Waffles does some heavy lifting. In the back end. I, every time I look at over over at OBS now, all I'm seeing is the freaking bit met the bits that Cat has sent me. <laughs> like my entire activity feed is just the bits that Cat has sent me. This sick cat. I can't believe you. All right, let's uh, get this wrapped up. Or not? Well, eh, yeah. If we can clear out the rest of this bottom bit, then we're gonna be on smooth ceiling. Because then we just need to finish the little tiny bit of the walls. As well as then actually get the rest of this sorted with flooring, get the roof built in, start moving over some machinery, 
making better passive lines over here. Then think about uh, upgrading the reactors a little bit. I'm so happy I actually made that freaking EV alloy smelter uh, last stream. Or at least I started making it last stream and I finished it off stream because Nichrome was taking a little while. And it was getting pretty lit. Ah. <sighs> Mining does take its time. But, oh well. Once I end stream tonight, I'll probably have to go and fix some things, like some redeems need to be updated, some... goals need to be updated again, because apparently I forgot to change my uh, follower goal from 250 to 275 when I thought I did. And I also thought I changed my... Well, that was literally it, yeah. It was just that. Okay. Break this time. Little bit more gravel still. Let me go this way after we eat a little bit of food. Yes, if anyone watching has not seen this pack before. Um, it is a very, very grindy expert pack. Um, it is in an older version of Minecraft, so if that's not anyone's style, that is completely acceptable. It is in 1.7. While a lot of people nowadays are playing, you know, 1.18, 1.20 packs. I play... A lot of newer packs off stream because I just sometimes can't get as invested in them as this one. I find that this has been, uh, it's actually been the furthest I've gotten in a pack without getting, uh, bored or burnt out, which is nice. Except for Vault Hunters, and Vault Hunters have went further in this way. Like, I've probably sunk more hours into Vault Hunters than I have this in total. But I, then again, do have quite a few hours in this. I think I'm up to the near... What are we at now? A thousand and forty-four hours. Great. Cool. Is this not claimed? No, it's not. Perfect. That has been rectified. Okay. Uh, let's head back on over here and continue mining this art. Okay. Yeah, 
getting rid of all of this stuff. It is completely fine by me. And that's gone, that's gone. That's good. Okay. And the slow, painful process of removing this last strip has begun. Yes, but yes, since I couldn't earlier, but I should be able to now, let's actually get that shard out for blood done fully. There we go. If you have not followed blood, I'd recommend doing so. But uh, we couldn't get the shard out off while blood was here due to how which limits how many shard outs you can do every so often. But we got it done now. So if you haven't already, I'd recommend following blood. They're great. They haven't. They've just come back to streaming recently, and uh, yeah, always a pleasure to chill out in his stream. Let's add in our little art skirt block. And a bit more stone. Okay, let's go back upstairs in a second. Okay. We're gonna break all of this and it's gonna be annoying as hell. But we're gonna have to do it anyway. This one I wish I'd excavate, but we don't. That stays there, and then I get here. The longer I do this, uh, the quicker the bricks will technically be done, because that means the more clay that's already smelted into bricks for us. I want to add some, like, major support pillars in here at some point. Thank you for the push-ups, cat. Thank you for the plank, too. I'll do them in a minute. Just let me get an over one of these segments done. I was not supposed to go there. Okay. Let me go and do them real quick. Oh, 
by Petra. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Whoa. There we go. Whoa. Whew. Those planks keep getting harder each time I do them. Which means they're working. I'm gonna probably take a swig of water. Whoa. That's a lot better. That was not what I was supposed to do. I literally just mined the same block I just placed. That is amazing. Absolutely wonderful. And get rid of that. Okay. And we're what complete loop. And then we can go grab some more bricks. Perfect. Boom, boom. Ah. Back to the old bears. And then we'll dump all that in there. And turn the rest of that to that. More small piles. Perfect. And then we grab a whole bunch of clay. That'll do its job, make us some more bricks. That's sure gonna take its time making that electrum.
There we go. Now we'll listen to Minecraft music. But low firing. We'll grab all of that, dump it in there. Ores and impure dust. Okay, let's go and uh, dump all this into the ore processing then. The old bass. Perfect. Look at all that thorium and monazite. Take it into the drawer room. Deposit it. And there we go. How is our thorium situation? Good. We have good amounts of thorium. Gold's also looking pretty nice. Copper's looking good. Iron's looking brilliant. But yeah, let's uh, get more stuff built over there. So we're going to need our roof blocks. We do actually have. So, I don't know, let's empty my inventory, essentially. Or my hot bar. Eat full. Uh... Makes these around a little bit. Like that, that'll do. And then we'll go build my roof. Thank you for the lurk bucket. I appreciate it. Building this always takes so much time, but it is always uh, satisfying once it's done. That's it done. I could never imagine building in uh, creative or with world edit. I love building with uh, my own two hands. It gives me more satisfaction.
We're just moving back as fast as we can. I'll spin in my mouse wheel freely. That's the only real way we can build. With, uh, random. At least. And there we go. There we go. That's a lot nicer. Yeah, let's go back to not the old base, but that's fine. We can grab more clay while we're here. Nice. Um, four, one, two. That wasn't a full four stack, so we can take it. But there is three stack. We're going to put in there. Uh, yep, we're going to need more. Black granite. Nine more stacks of black granite, please. That will do lovely. Um, I know it hasn't been that long since the last break, but I'm going to go quickly on another one. Um, if anyone else needs to use the, if anyone needs bathroom, get themselves a drink, walk around a little bit, maybe take medication you need to. I'd recommend doing so now, and uh, yeah, I'll see you after Rick in a little minute. I also forgot I have, I'm going to run a little ad here. A little ad break courtesy of Trogan. Um, so yeah. Yeah, see you after the break.
And I'm back. Thanks for second run during the break, everybody. I appreciate it. Thank you for the welcome back, QA. There we go. Back to more roof building. Everyone's favorite thing in the known universe. Indeed, Jess. Roof. I do actually quite like just spinning my Mars wheel while I just hold S and right click. <laughs> It's quite easy and also quite relaxing. And it's fairly simple to do. Yeah, it actually is. It's quite it's quite relaxing. If I have any more black granite, there's tons of old ore chunks I can go to to grab more. But this is great. I just thought of something I really want to add to, uh, I think this building. Jess, you know an old style uh, factory, um, you know one of those old style factory uh, chimneys? I really want to add one of them now. And have it be like really light at the bottom, but the higher you go up on it, the darker it gets. Um, for some reason of like soot, and then it turns into a nice black color using the basalt. Basalt's lighter than this, but it would uh, work better. Game. Apparently the game was lagging a tiny bit, but not too much. Yeah, okay, let's grab some more black granite then. We do need this. Oh, 
pam pam. Right, let's fill in this hole. Okay. That is most of this filled in. Final layer. The song that's currently on. Joy. If you want, I can tell you the name of it. Um. That is the name of the song. And it is by... By Coffee Dan Game Shops. There we go. Yes, yeah, so if you're interested in that song, that is the name of it. There's a lot of songs in this play in this radio I could listen to forever. Because lo fi is that because there's many similar lo-fi songs, right? But they all sound different in their own way. Know the name, just not who covered it? Gotcha. Okay, there's more black granite to add to the pile. Don't have enough. Okay, we're gonna go to an ore at near the old base. We'll go grab some more. Um, what did I need? I needed that. As well as that. And we'll fill up this chest and then we'll go grab that. Go refill the water tank this quickly <clears throat> perfect Yeah, so let's uh, head out this direction after we take a little bit of a nap. And we'll just head directly down here. I'm going to go grab some uh, black granite.
Let's get that. And there. Very nice. A little bit more. There we go. We got uh, quite a bit of it. And then all we need to do is... Perfect. Almost like nothing happened. Yeah, that should uh, tide us over for a little bit. Gravel at that. Put the black grunt in there. Perfect. Nine stacks of the stuff. There we go. No, all we need to do is... Uh, randomly... Pick. These, like that. Perfect! I just gotta run along back to the new building and continue putting in part of the roof the basement. That's where we left off. Perfect. It's good that we're mixing some cracked in with this because uh, that also gives it a bit more of a worn down feeling. But also not too worn down. Once we've uh, finished with this hot bar, we should be able to take a pretty good look at what we've done. See how it looks.
Okay. This is very nice. We're getting close to needing to half some other things to pick up other slots. Like, look at that. I, ooh, I genuinely like that roof. It looks like it looks pretty decent, you know? Definitely helps this area down here pop a little bit more. Lunchbox, miscellaneous. Okay, let's uh, let's get some more of this. Well, that's not an actual fan of it. So let's head back to the old base again. Go grab some more black granite from somewhere. I know a lot of people who have watched me recently actually haven't seen the old base when it was uh, functional. Looks better than my base. That's a cure. Come on. You're playing Garden of Grind. There has to be some jank to be acceptable, you know? I second that. Oh my god. I still want to change up some stuff with my current base. There's definitely some stuff I can improve upon. Like, my... I'm noticing there's a very lack of... a lot of lack of, you know, of a better word to fucking say is... It's very blocky. Very blocky in some parts, but then some other parts are very, you know, nice and nicely shaped. Uh, mostly the push progression for months. Yeah, that's why I don't. That's why I don't like using the old base too much because it was completely progression progressing. Uh, freaking! I can't speak now. Uh, my old base was completely just. Hey, uh, we need room to put machines. Cool. Build another cube. <laughs> you know? While... Um, my new base is a lot more... You know? Clean looking. Well, not really cl It's not clean, per se, but it's a lot less, you know... Cube to go here, cube to go there. It's more of a... A bit of a... Quirky ship, or something. Especially this new building. The new building's a bit more quirky in ship, and I kind of, I kind of like it. Okay. 
eat some food. Build a cube, my best was a platform with a flat roof. Well, it's, you know, it's essentially a cube, right? It's better than digging in a hole. That's all I really cared about with uh, a lot of things was, does this look better than just if I dug a hole in the floor? Yes, then it is good. At least I have plenty uh, to do normal waiting for neutronium. Mmm, yeah. I wish they made Garden of Grind uh, completable. I think they will at some point make it completable. Just for a sore reason of there's people who play it and they're like, eh, might as well, you know? At least I would hope they would make it completable at some point. I still need to update my uh, pack version. I'm still on 2.4, I've just realized. I'll find time either this weekend or next weekend to get it updated. slime below me, it's making so much freaking noise. That should be enough for a wee while. Let me just grab this easy to get part and home near. Next to them, please. Oh. 
Uh, you can almost get it, but it needs a sapling from the twilight and B in a magical dimension. Oh, and let me guess, with Garden of Grind, you're not allowed to go to the twilight. Because that would kind of defeat the point. Yeah. Well, you could also go to the personal dim. The personal dim's not really changing anything if you go there. Like, if it's, like, just essentially a super flat personal dim. That's only changing the layout. You could do a super flat run instead as well. It's the exact same thing as a Garden of Grind, except you don't need to die constantly at the beginning. So it makes hardcore Garden of Grind possible. Uh, Spectre Dimension is an option for the Magical Dimension, and the Sapling should drop from a Thongcraft crop, but it's bugged. Great. That's, that's amazing. Hopefully they'll fix that. Or if not, someone can at least make, like, a custom recipe for it. Specifically for Garden of Grind. Or even better, just... Even if the GTNH crew don't natively support it, if someone would make, like, an add-on mod just for Garden of Grind, that would work. You know? That adds all the recipes and stuff that you need. I'll probably get as far as I can and then cheat them in throwing away equivalent stuff. That, that'll work, yeah. I'd say that's reasonable. We're gonna run out again, but we have enough back in the back in the store system to ignore that. Look at that. Oh 
That's looking good. Looking good indeed. Okay, let's uh, get an order nine stacks of them then. Actually, I could get away with four, four and a half. Because I don't need that much, I can just split them into half stacks. Be cracked or fitted, fitted. Okay, so half of you go there. There we go. I have them randomly arranged, and now all we're gonna do is go and get these placed. And this is going pretty well. And this way. But it's good to know that you like it too, Kyoi, because I'm half, like, I like it, but I'm also like, hmm, does this fit with the other bit of the roof? And does it fit with the bottom? Does it fit with the walls? You know, it's kind of that scenario. Does it, does it fit? But it does. We go black granite cobblestone. Now we need to grab our bricks that we prepared earlier. Turn that into varied, that into varied. Yeah, 13 each. I'm finally making a flu. Let's go, Bruce. Also, hello, Bruce. How have you been? I haven't seen you in a wee bit here. How goes it? this why do bats have to exist good past my nightmare uh machine learning course on my final attempt at re-exam was oh. okay and oh Then if we grab our six ones, let's go five, six, seven, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen.
This is way easier than it was before because I can just split these evenly now. Without a care in the world. Five, seven, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Then we grab both those. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Go, go. Seven, 10, 11, 12, 13. 11, 12, 13. I uh, got UVF. Uh, just set up. And let's rush the light fuel and now I'm making a fluid solidifier. Yeah. What's the fluid solidifier for? Rubber, I would guess. We did indeed not have enough bricks. <laughs> well we got a most of that bit done. And Oh my god, it's April Shars. Yeah, rubber, and then there are the recipes that just get easier. Yeah. That is not where you want to go. Uh, we should actually have, like, a stack of cobble in there. Yeah, perfect. I love this song. It's so nice. But it's good to hear you're progressing, Bruce. Always good to hear that someone's making progress and stuff in GTA Niche. And dark panel, dark panel, dark panel. Of course, they're not classified as uh, part of the digger's backpack, but they should they actually might be part of the builder's backpack now I think about it. There we go. Another corner. Okay. 
Let's get another bit of a dark panel up in here. Perfect. That is that done. Look at that. A lot cleaner. Now all we need is more stone, which we can get from our log pipe system. Stone bricks. Mind if don't mind if I do. And also six stacks. That should do it. For sure. Okay, that should do for right now. Let's go and uh, see how we do. I love the fact that repellators are actually working so well. We've had, like, no issues for a while with uh, mobs. Which is really nice. Perfect. Now I just need the bricks to finish this off, and then the flooring, which isn't too bad. The flooring is just some polished stone, uh, some marble, mixed between marble, cracked marble, all that good stuff. And that's just placed down, and uh, then we'll have a fully functioning area. And we can also give this a bit of a touch up on both sides, add maybe a little bit of a stone in there. Actually, I could do that now. Let me just do that now. I might as well. This side. Replacing this with A2 is going to be a bit of a pain, but we're going to need to do it eventually. Does not. Okay, no more stack of stone. Perfect. Look at that. Magnificent. That then takes us back into our base. Which on the internals is actually got this as its guideline. 
We're also going to need to redo this area a little bit, especially when we're, you know, once we add A2, I'm going to move this macerator elsewhere. I'm going to replace it with a macerator stack somewhere and all that good stuff. Because this area I'm going to rip out completely and move over here. Especially since that actually lets me put in my uh, archway that I want. So it lets me walk the entire way along here. In a nice fashion. Then I also want to add some decoration for the Batania area. Make it really nice. I want a water tar. Going about, I'd say maybe... Here-ish? Here-ish, with a giant plant wrapping around it. For a bit of spice. Um, but yes, yeah, this, this is going good. This is coming together a lot better than it was before. So, let's grab some bricks and, uh, cause some mischief. Three, four, one. Perfect. That's a ton more bricks for us. And we've also got a bit of copper and iron that we need to put away. Is there a cosmetic... Is there a cosmetic armory in uh, 1.7? Because if there is, I might, I might add it to the pack. Um... Just so I can actually hide, like, my nanosuit and stuff. Or even just have something else over the top of it. I'd much rather not have, you know, just a bunch of nanosuit on me all the time. Especially, like, helmet-wise, I'd rather be able to see my head. I'm going to go on another quick break. Um, but yeah, I'm going to go quick break. If anyone needs to use the bathroom themselves, get a drink, stretch your legs, get something to snack on, all that good stuff, uh, I'd recommend doing so now, and I'll see you after the break. See you in a little bit.
Okay, I'm back. Thank you for the thank you for sticking around during the break, everybody. I appreciate it. Alright. Um Thank you for the welcome back, QI. Uh let's get done to business. Um those bricks done yet? Yeah, they are. Okay, perfect. We'll get those. Okay, let's head on over then. I love this path so much already. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Nice. It's good that fluid solidifier is done then, Bruce. There we go. So not where that wants to go. Three, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. And we fill in the rest. Boom. You know we're like half stack of bricks and we're good. So yeah, we can go do that. This is a big area down here. Like a big area. I'm just thinking maybe I should subdivide this, like into segments. But then I'm also like, the walls kind of already do that on the behind bit. If I really want to, I can divide them by segment like that. But yeah, let's go grab those bricks. Actually, never mind. We only need 20. Uh, so, half you could have varied. Perfect. Let's just take a gander over here. Or dander, I mean, not a gander. A gander means look, dander means walk.
Perfect. Look at that. It's done. The walls, the bricks have been laid. Finally. Um, not all we need to do is get a ton of marble and polish down. I think I'm also a bit iffy on the polished stone. I also kind of want to rip out this and redo it. I don't think the polished stone works that well with this part, so... Yeah, let's rip that out and we're going to change it. There we go. I just don't like the way the polished stone looks on this part. Okay. Especially since this is way too many cracked marble in it as well, anyway. The, uh, the polished stone combination works fine for, like, outside walls, but for interior floors, not really. It don't work too well for that. I wish there was like a lighter version of that concrete. Like that would be nice. Like a, like a white version would work perfectly. Like in here. Okay. Okay. So we grab all of this. Okay, perfect. That is that cleared up. Now let's go and see if we can find uh, something better to match it with. So if we take out the marble bricks, we take a look in here. Is there any other brick variants that may fit better? Um. There's the marble from Chisel. Um, that's Project Red's marble, but it's too, way too different. Let's see, what happens if I place this in a mixture? That looks alright, but there's no brick texture on top, which kind of is a bit iffy with me. I'd really want bricks on top as well.
there any other like whitish bricks? If I look up bricks or brick, um, let's see. We could just get col white colored bricks. Like they, they would work. They would work, so would frosty ones, but they're a bit annoying looking. Iron would work, but they cost iron. Um, Yeah, um, let's just go paint some bricks white and see how they look. Uh, give me a paint brush and then white dye. Ooh, that'll work. Perfect. Absolutely amazing. Have to get some sleep on my stream? No problem, QI. Hope you have a lovely sleep, and I'll uh, see you around. Hey, Sora. How's it going? One, two, three, four. Boom. Okay. And then we just gotta go boom, boom. And then just go boop, boop, boop. There we go. Uh, good. Yeah, I'm doing grand. We're doing good. We're actually getting some building done. We're starting progressing on the build. Again, it's going to on the current longest stand block in Minecraft. Nice! That is quite an achievement, Jess. Its name, waxed underscore extreme underscore algae underscore covered underscore pool underscore tiles. Great. That is amazing. Shit. I just realized that this has been refilling shit. Oh, I need to go back and fix. I need to go back along and remove all these. How many modifiers does this have? Three? I can add residence to easy mode soon. I can go back to... Actually, I'm... Do it now. Go 
Give me like four stacks of redstone. Thirty two, two forty, two forty eight, two fifty. Need two more redstone. I need 20 more redstone. Okay. Uh, let me just eat from my lunchbox real quick. Yeah, let's go back to the old base real quick and let's get a... Uh... Let's change our food. Uh, thank you for the hydrate blending. Hello, how are you doing, good sir? Mm -hmm. There we go, water has been consumed. Is that, did you bring out the blending twerking amount? You did. <laughs> okay. Let's go, Jess. <laughs> That's a good uh, making rubber rings in the solidifier. Hell yeah. I sure love having to go back and fix a mistake because I forgot that my backpack was on auto refill and it didn't, it only works on some blocks. Cool, yay, fun. Oh, I'm so happy I put haste on this thing now. Oh, that's so much better. Yes, Blending, how, how are you doing? How is today going? Time to look for... Wherever the hell I put the knife this time. Let's go. There we go. And okay, good. Um, Let's keep going. Let's keep spinning the wheel until we uh, get this done. Okay. I do love 
Oh, this is, uh, this looks a lot nicer than it was before. A lot nicer already just by the amount that I'm seeing or building. Looks a lot more clean. And it fits better. There we go. Oh, that is a lot better. Like, a lot better now. Look at that. So much nicer looking. Four. The rest of that goes in there. I'm gonna need more of these, so back to the new base. Bone mail. Don't break. There we go, we got a bit, quite a bit of wood ash, so we should be able to make seven stacks of bone mill. We should be more than enough to make enough uh, stone brick block there. Get a brush back up in here. Stone. Let me get these uh, other four stacks of stone just chiseled up into bricks. There we go. Very nice. And we're good to go, so all the way. There we go. And to go and build.
Thank you for the follow. Thank you, sir. I appreciate it. This is going good. Please, thank you. Okay. Very nice. Anyway, has anyone been watching anything interesting recently? That's a good question. You know, what have people been watching recently? Or been playing? Other than GT Nature, of course, because it is the best game, right? Definitely. I just realized my frames dropped for a second there. Hmm. That's not too nice. Started watching uh, Studio Ghibli movies. Ooh. Very nice. I haven't watched any Studio Ghibli movies. If I like, I'm trying to remember. I don't think I've actually watched any. I should probably do that at some point. I'm just gonna make the executive decision of there we go there's that center bit done and that's a lot nicer than it was before oh that is so much nicer like oh There we go. Got us a new screenshot for, uh, or even better, this. This might be a good one. Anyway, um, I think this might be me for the night, so let's find a lovely individual who we can raid. One of the people we could rate is maybe I don't know who we could rate. Um Yep, okay. So slash red. Let's go and raid Diddy. Let us go and raid Diddy. So let me just get the stream pulled up here because I'm going to need it pulled up. But yes, let's uh, head on over there. Thank you for tuning in tonight. And I hope you, all of you have a lovely, fresh evening. Have a good time. Yes, you do, Nushi. <laughs> We're about to raise someone. <laughs> well, hello, Nushi, and also goodbye, Nushi. <laughs> But yes, um, I hope all of you have a lovely night.
And I'll see you again next time. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs>